Hi, babies. I missed you. Missed you a lot. And uh, the reason I've been gone is because I've been painting a lot. And it takes about eight hours to make painting. So, but I wanted to bring you in for the last moments of this one. Okay. So, oh yeah. Also, notice this is where I live now. See that where I, this is. Um, I basically live in a cave now. That's what this one's about. About a cave living. Yeah, I just got rid of the mattress altogether, and um, I had some champagne tonight because it's my last day of teaching. I hate being in charge of people's lives, judgment. Not for me. Not for me. But anyway, I had some champagne tonight. It was really good. And I'm celebrating because I, yeah, the last day of teaching. Thank God. So I'm just painting. You know. But the cats are playing. We're all playing. We all live in the cave. I just sleep on the floor. I just do things on the floor. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. I'm not promoting this for anyone's life, but I'm trying to find my passion. And I noticed that when I paint, I that's the only thing that is interesting to me. Everything else is really boring. Mostly just completely boring. And then when I paint, that's actually really fun. And time passes amazingly fast. It's purpose. Purpose-driven life. Ottman, you know, you get the um, mindlessness going on. Plus purpose. Okay. Plus just hang out by yourself, you know? That's what I do. Okay, so I have two things left over to do, and that's the green. So I'm just going to go for it, you guys. I know, you're like, what? Oh, yeah, what was I going to tell you about? My thesis project. My thesis project. Yeah, I was going to tell you about my thesis project. The thing is about the thesis project is that I don't know what it means necessarily. I just know that I found means of expressing something. I found that I looked at some, I found that um, one can Yeah, I found that one can create a world of their own through art. And then, you know, everyone's really, you know, they can even think and express that to everybody else. Yep, and all my students are going to do really well. I would be surprised if any of my students didn't get an A. I'm not, I'm not joking. It's because they're all geniuses this semester. They just, they really get it. They really got what's going on. Yeah, we all worked through it together, and I would be really surprised if they didn't all get these. Really surprised. Like, the only thing I don't like about school is like the clothing situation. I don't like to wear clothes, so let alone. Ugh. Professor clothes. I mean, it's not for me. It's not for me. But okay. It's for me. I love mathematics. You know what we talked about? You know what? Let's see. Um divergence and curl. You know, all that stuff, divergence and curl. It's like <clears throat> To me, it kind of seems like you're taking the beauty of water and you're deconstructing it. It's like, <sighs> okay. No, and I, I think it's probably just because, like, this is not my main interest. I, I'm more interested in, like, logic. I love teaching about, like, combinatorics or, like, um, just logic. Like, truth tables. Yeah. Set theory. Yeah, set theory. That's what I really like to do. But next year, when I'm an artist, I'm just going to go to the set theory seminars. That's my main, that's going to be, that's going to be my main tie-in. 
yeah, you guys are like, you're not going to do it. You're, oh, yeah. I know you guys are, are like, I know you guys are like, yeah, you're going to do it. Yeah, I know I'm going to do it. I already, it already happened. Anyway, guys, I'm really happy. <sighs> I'm happy to be here with you, that I'm talking to you. That's what makes me happy I like when people are watching me. Mm -hmm. Let's just get a little more green in there. Oh, yeah, I was going to say that it's like a dream, like, it's like a thesis project. It's not like I know what it means, um, but it's like a dream. Like, it tells me what it means. It's going to tell me what it means. And maybe, but it doesn't mean that what it tells me what it means is what it tells you what it means. It's just that it's coming from somewhere else. I guess that's what it means. It's not coming from me necessarily, unless you, unless I consider me to be something. So I'm like, I'm just like watching it, watching it, see what, see what it says to me. I like watching my cats and it just seems like so natural that they just like want to be together. Oh, you want to know how the, how the cave life is living? How's the cave life? Oh, living, like sleeping on the floor and stuff like that. It's awesome. I don't know why. It's just awesome. I like camping. I love camping. So it's pretty much like camping every night. I get up a bunch in the night because of my little kitty, Zeke. It's his birthday today also, Mr. Zeke. One years old. One years old and he already has a wife. Probably kids on the way. I don't know. Yep. He's been outside before. Oh, whoops. Whoopsie daisies. Oh, whoopsies. Yeah, Zeke's been outside before. They would be great outdoor cats, but they have to stay inside for now. Sure love some of the art galleries I've seen in this neighborhood. Well, I only saw one. Oh, yeah. The Kingsmith Gallery. I mean, it's the best one ever. Yeah, that's really cool. They're really cool there. I just think that those people are very beautiful and cool and i want to be a part of it and i want to be able to just be myself all the time i like i like to hang out truthfully i like to hang out talk about stuff <sighs> but you know oh yeah politics that's what gets more that's stupid you guys politics are dumb i just read the papers i have an opinion about that but that's it that's it an opinion, but I also understand the other opinion a lot. It's just things are going pretty good though right now. I am grateful for the uh, what's it called? Uh, acknowledgement of the protest in Hong Kong and Taiwan. Ugh. Okay, you guys, let's not worry about that right now. Let's get to the gold. Except that I really, really, really need to, um, if I don't paint that green the way I want to paint it, I'm going to go crazy. So I better do that. Yeah. That's how this operates. Go crazy and then I'll look at it later. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Fail great. <clears throat> That's Mr. Zeke. It's okay, Mr. Zeke. It's gonna be fine. I'm completely against administration of schools and hospitals. I don't know. Ugh. I just don't get why.
I just don't get why the teachers don't just pick what classes they want to teach and the students pick what classes they want to take and they line it up like that and I just don't get why there's all the like unnecessary complications. It really harms the students and the teachers, but they don't seem to mind that. Whoops, whoops, and whoops, and sorry about that. That was a cat. I, I went on a rant. It really drives me crazy. That's why I'm getting out. <clears throat> Everyone should just be able to be themselves. But you know what? It actually turned out pretty good in my multi class, at least. That's because the students are super smart. Like, duh, they already know this stuff. I mean, like, why do I have to teach them anything? They already know this stuff. That's what it seems like. Oh, well. It's my karma to unfold. It's like this unwinding thing. I've been, when I was 18 years old, I wanted to quit. I've always wanted to be an artist my entire life. But, um, when I was young, my mom said, oh, those are just doodles. I was like, mom, I figured out a new way of coloring. And she's like, those are just doodles. And then when I got older, I was like, hmm, I like art. But I was also really good at math. I guess I wasn't, like, really good. I just liked it. I was okay at it. I was okay at it. But then people were like, oh, well, if you can do math, you should just do math. That's cool. I'm glad I did math. I mean, I'm very glad I met Joel Hamkins. Like, my God. But other, I mean, I'm glad I know about Southern. You know, I'm glad that I know the bottom of it. I know it's at the bottom of math. And I know that it's a <laughs> girdle showed us that it's. We don't know. We know we don't know in such a beautiful way. Math is just it's very beautiful and I am going to be a great mathematician. I, I just I the only reason I say that you guys is because I know that it's true. That's the only reason I say it. But it might take me some time to get there. But I will appreciate your support. I really do. I really appreciate your support. <clears throat> I don't know why I studied math, but I did for some reason. Anyway, the point is I always wanted to be an artist, and that's what I'm going to do, you guys. And you know what? Maybe I can go to set theory seminars. Oh, yeah, I already said that. Yeah, I'm just, like, letting all my rage out. Yeah, it's a lot. I have a lot of rage about that. It bothers me a lot. It's like, oh, yeah, what I was going to say was, oh, yeah, when I was 18, I was like, I'm quitting college, you guys. I'm quitting college. I'm going to work in the movie theater because I was happy there. I was happy there. I had those skates. I had those shoes that turned into skates and you roll around. And I was wearing paint clothes. I was painting, wearing dickies every day t to school. It was great. It was a great time. You know? I was like, that's what I want to do is work at the movie theater and just do art. But no, my mom said, you have to go to college. So. I'm sure I would have figured it out myself, but come on, you guys. Come on. Why did That's the way I should have been doing. It's the only thing that, like, unless I'm, like, reading Yuck or something. I mean, come on, you guys. That's all there is. Anyway, I'm just, you guys, I'm just like messing around. I'm a little bit messing around. Kind of half the time messing around. I mean, yeah, I get it. I get it. I get the whole thing. It's good that I studied math. Look at that. That looks pretty cool. Okay, you guys, last step. I'm serious about sharing my feelings. I do get very upset about my choices sometimes. I really do. But you know what? I'm going to show that... Life is, like, kind of long, I guess. Life is long. And you can figure it out. What you want to do along the way. Okay. So, one more thing left, you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me tonight. I really appreciate it. And I just wanted to just do a little bit of a Thomas Kincaid kind of... If you don't like it, then you're crazy. Thomas Kincaid kind of. 
There we go. Can we get a little more Thomas King K up in here? Okay, here we go. There you go, babies. It's for you. Okay, one more. Actually, two more. Is Mr. Zeke? Oh, yeah. Let's see, you guys need to see this. You guys need to see this happening. I really just like the company, honestly. To be truthful, I don't really hang out there with that, that many people uh, anymore, but I used to. And I like hanging out with people, especially cool people, like Sam or all kinds of cool people. It's a long time. Anyways, I, I have a lot of friends. Too, I do. Mr. Z is one of them. Okay, guys, one more little be a fest. Made that word up. It means the beautifest part of it. But the mom, what about me? Mr. Zeke says it's my birthday. <laughs> you're not even talking to me. Sorry, Mr. Zeke. You're That's it, boss. Okay, that's it. Cave lives. Thanks for hanging out. Truly appreciate it. Thanks for watching, my boobs.